Tonight, the NYPD is asking for the public's help in finding a man seen on video making anti-Semitic statements and spitting on a Jewish man. The investigation comes after the New York Attorney General and DAs from across the state addressed the recent escalation of attacks in the city on Jews and pledged to prosecute all hate crimes. CBS 2's Lisa Raza reports from the Upper West Side tonight. Sunday afternoon on Amsterdam Avenue near West 86th Street, video shows the man in red yell free Palestine and spit on a visibly Jewish man as he crosses the street. The person who took the footage is also Jewish and wanted to speak out, but is too afraid to show her face for fear of retaliation. This was such a random, unprovoked incident. It could happen to anybody. Strangers jump in to protect the Jewish man who the NYPD said is 74 and did not suffer any injuries. The witness says moments prior to that video, glass was thrown at the man. The NYPD says the suspects now wanted for aggravated harassment, and this is being investigated as a hate crime. NYPD data shows anti-Semitic hate crimes have increased 60% compared to this time last year. I don't understand how people could have so much hate for someone they don't even know. This is happening all over. There's a brazenness for sure. Avi Posnick is with Stand With Us, a nonprofit that educates people on anti-Semitism. To think about what could have happened if there weren't people who came to this man's aid. There needs to be consequences uh, for these actions. I felt good in that, knowing that there were, we were a group of us confronting this man, but still, I mean, that's crazy. She and other Jews we spoke to say speaking up is one step everyone can take because New Yorkers are stronger together. On the Upper West Side, Lisa Rosner, CBS 2 News.